guys, it's Katrina from Mancoon Central. Welcome to my YouTube channel. I'm super excited you're here because today I am doing another unboxing. Uh, this was a little bit of an unexpected unboxing. Basically, we did have uh, one of the Catmate brand water fountains, uh, which Pippin loved it. It was really good, nice wide bowl so that his whiskers weren't bent. However, what we at first thought to be a good water fountain didn't really last. So it hit just over a year. Uh, warranty obviously at that point expired, so we couldn't return it. And a couple of days back, it basically just completely stopped working. So we had to choose another cat water fountain. So here it is. The Amazon guy has just dropped it off. So I've not looked inside the box, I've literally just opened it for ease. Um, and let's see what this little man here, I think you can see him. There we go. Oh, he's looking a little bit lazy at the moment. Let's have a look to see what this little man thinks of his new water fountain. So, just get out of the box. Oh, they've just raced off on the noise of the boxes. So it comes in a really compact box. So I'm quite interested to see just how big it is in reality. Because if I'm honest, my husband purchased it. So I did sort of say loosely with the type of one that I was specifically wanting. Let's just see which one he bought. So, as you can see, all nicely covered up inside. So what I'm gonna do now is take off all the packaging and set it up. Okay, so I've taken everything out of the package now and I thought it might be useful if I show you exactly how to set up this pet water fountain, just so that no one gets confused. As I said, it's a super cute one with a little petal on it. Um, which is, I've seen our next door neighbour's cats using, if I'm completely honest, and it works a total treat. Right, so in the package, there are three filters. The petal that goes at the top where the water kind of comes out and trickles over the top. There's the base unit where you actually fill with water. Obviously the plug to power it and another thing that you stick inside. Okay, so if we look at the pet water fountain instructions, the first thing it says, it basically says take out all the equipment and accessories. The next thing that I'm now just gonna go and do is number two. It says basically wash out the basin. So just gonna go and do that then. The next bit it says on the instructions is you basically just fill the basin with water. So I've got that waiting just in the bathroom at the moment. Now, number three, take out the filter. Very good to have on a cat water bowl. Make sure the water that's coming through to your cat remains clean and all filtered. Now, it says take out the filter and soak the filter in water for cleaning. So I'm just gonna go and do that. On number four is install the filter into the upper cover and cover the tray. So basically you take this part of the device and it just, whoop, just comes off. And then you take the filter, so here's a dry version, and then it just slots on. So as you can see, there is a hole right there in the middle. It literally just slots onto this circle in the middle. Don't forget to do it with the wet filter though. Okay, so this is the cleaned water filter, the basin, with the filter inside and the lid now put on. The last final touch is to put this super adorable little flower on top. Now, if you've not seen one of these before, these are literally purchasable from Amazon. 
Um, so if you've got Prime like us, then you can have it for the next day. Um, that just slots down, so it's only about not even quite an inch or so there. And the next thing we're going to do is I'm actually going to put it into the utility room now um, and turn the power on so that you can see it actually in action. And I've got a feeling that this chap behind me, although he's sleeping now, might get a little bit interested when he sees this going on because he does like to follow us all around the house and know exactly what we're up to all the time. Okay, so I have just turned the water fountain on and as you can see, it's all lit up in pretty blue colour and the water is pouring out of the petal at the top. Pippin's come to have a look to see what's going on. What do you think he's going to think of it? What do you think, Pips? Look. Pips, it's water. So, I will keep you tuned on what Pippin gets up to with this particular water fountain. As you see at the moment, he's obviously not thirsty.